to talk about creating the video clips from different uh, letters of ASL, American Sign Language. And then in the second part, I will talk about how to create frames out of uh, these video clips. So I created two versions. So this is the first version I created. Uh, a friend of mine helped me to create this clip. You can see that it's not too long. It's about seven, eight minutes, eight seconds. And the other version I created in front of a, a in front of an orange wall. Um, if I couldn't find any black or dark area, you uh, you can or or a screen, I can do it in front of a um, a wall. By the way, I highly recommend that you use a dark space because you can see some shadows of hand and shadows of my body over there. It makes the job of labeling a bit harder. So that is my uh, suggestion regarding the creating the video clips. Create multiple video clips uh, from your hand. Probably at the first try, it's not the best one you created. In these two video clips, you can see I'm moving my hand. And my friend just uh, uh, creating the video uh, uh, without moving the camera. You can also move the camera. Instead of uh, I'm uh, instead of I move my hand to create dif create different angles or view angles from uh, my hand posture, my friend could move the uh, camera from left to right or right to left and then uh, observe my hand from different angles. So both of them uh, could be uh, possible, uh, whatever which is easier for you. Tr try to make several of these video clips. Uh, in some of the clips, you can see I did not include my arm at all. And in some of them, you can see some part of my arm is there. So create multiple uh, frames to make sure you have different variations of your hand. And also your friend can help you uh, uh, by creating that, that the same posture that is assigned to you. Uh, so uh, in this way, you will have a, a variety of uh, different, um, uh, different, uh, different uh, views from um, from hand posture for each of the uh, each of the letters of American Sign Language. In the second part of the uh, the uh, video, I would like to talk about the the software that helps you to um, create frames out of the video clips. So the the software called VLC Media Player probably you have it already. It's a free software. You can download it and install on your system. I already installed it, and uh, uh, this is the environment of that. In VLC, there is a preferences page, uh, which is the setting of the software. In Windows, you will have the similar settings. And in this menu, you can see some basic uh, settings. Uh, but we need some advanced settings to convert the video clips to um, to multiple frames. In the preferences page, click on show all. And here you can see a bunch of uh, uh, filters and uh, uh, extra settings that you can set. Make sure that you go to the video part and in the video part, there are several sections. Make sure that you click on filters. And in this part, uh, find scene video filter and check it. Make sure that it's selected. Afterwards, go to the settings of scene filter as well. So it's checked here in video frames. When you select it, you can see the settings. Make sure it's checked and here in the scene filter settings, these are the settings you can uh, set for the uh, for creating the uh, frame of uh, the different frames from a video clip. So I stored my um, uh, my video clips in this directory on desktop, 
uh, under the category which I called V. And let's say I'm going to create uh, frames for uh, uh, for uh, um, each uh, uh, frames each five frame of the video. For example, I'm going to extract from frame one, frame six, frame eleven, and so on. Therefore, here in recording ratio, I should put number five. And I created a directory called frame dash five under the under the directory of v that I already put my video clips there. You can put it any other places. By the way, you need to make sure that this directory exists. So I create the directory here, and I will call it frame five or frames five exactly the same name uh, I put it in the settings make sure it is not selected the always write to the same file is not selected and then also make sure that you put the prefix as the letter of alphabet you are creating for example this is V I put capital V there and when you save it and play the video once more. So let me just play the video with VLC again. If you look at the directory, it's creating those frames for me. All right, so the number of frames it's creating, you can select all and here it seems I created um 44 um 44 samples or 44 frames take a look at the frames you created so these are some of the frames i created and make sure you have different variations and different view angles of the letter so this is the other video opened afterwards so take a look at the the them and make sure they are created with several variations you can also uh, do the same thing for the other uh, clips that you created each of you need to at least create 100 frames so make sure that when you are submitting you at least created 100 uh, frames per letter or pair object you are creating. Uh, in the next video, I will show you how to upload um, the clips that you have created and also the frames that you extracted from them uh, to your GitHub repository and how to uh, make a pull request to ask uh, for merging to another repository afterwards. Thank you very much.